witless Vikings in the bot lane at level 20. Ouch. Do you think they stop implementing heroes after the next three? Because of the quick match heroes presentation? No. They've... No, I don't think so, Nimeon. They'll just go to a second page or, or redesign the UI. That's a good question. Hey, you have a great, great Friday too, Mark Cuckoo. Why am I first pick every time? I don't want to pick tier one. So wh what can I choose from? Toronda, Lunara, Stitches, Ether, Dahaka, Falsa, Sonya, Rexar, Tassadar. Tassadar is good here, but I don't feel like taking him again. Maybe Sylph. What can I take? Asmodan. I will fight to my last breath. Or Tychus. Let's jam. Let's jam. Aha! Free book. You got what you wanted. Time you're ready. Man, what's up with all the raiders these days? I don't answer questions about it, Hugh the Titan. Oh, you're probably right so though. Summer. Why hot on Saturday? It's not Saturday, it's Friday. I'm in NA time zone. Do you really go in Rage on Butcher? Is it better than Blood Frenzy because of the pumped up Relentless? Yeah, the Relentless on Butcher at 16 is 75%, it's pretty good. It's also the safer choice, Cryptic, because it allows you to walk away. Blood Frenzy, as the name suggests, doesn't. And although Blood Frenzy has better DPS, uh, Butcher's DPS is already so good, it's survivability that's his uh, problem. That's why I go in Rage. Plus, in certain situations and rage is actually better survivability and damage just because you can actually uh, out heal the damage you're taking and get more autos off by not being stunned so like in theory craft blood frenzy is better against buildings blood frenzy is better it but in rage time. i feel like it has way more applications ah yes that's right you're a big fan of asmodan right blood Cram? All because of your Raynard, like I said. No, that's all right, Aki. Thanks. From order, glory to the whole. Three dollars every time you dunk kill Snitch. All right, Crowtail. Thanks. I take that challenge with relish. Hey, we need a ranged assassin, huh? We need ranged assassin. I'm a number we don't think already. It's okay ish. Sorry. Sorry, it's nice. Better than Lunara. The swarm indoors. We need a solo laner down there. Or, I guess it could be Rexar as well. When we already have Rhaegar, Zul, and Rexar on Osmo, I don't feel like we need another tank. If we did that, we would not have enough damage. Zul's damage is unreliable. And uh, Rexar can function as a solo warrior. People just don't uh, know exactly how yet. There's very, li very little data from pro games available about it as well, about like how to sell a warrior with him. We do have triple specialist, but Sigara offers the early game advantage, which Asmodan is sorely missing. Yeah, 
Takashi on the bench. Upvotes for the Demon Warrior. What kind of tea am I drinking? Green tea. Long Sing Green Tea. Long, I think it's spelled like this. It's a Chinese kind of uh, green leaf tea. Now they have Tassadar, which is pretty good for me and Zagara. As Tassadar has some problems with... Uh... Oh, it still works. So he did 20% uh, damage. Thank you on the healing fountain shields, that change really helped us. Yeah, it works very well. Should just cancelled his attack. Tassadar is very good, yes. He's at least tier 2. I prefer Tassadar as a second support, not solo. My stacks is pretty poor. Could have been better, but we had a few miscoordinations. I really need Sagara to come back. Army of Hell. Head to a healing fountain while there is still time. Just take some free heals. One stack. Not too great. Need to go for some mana anyway. I thought there was a minion wave coming in. Anyway, I have to go back. Normally at level 10, I used to like to get 110 uh, stacks in the old patch. But now I would like to get 150. But I'm very far behind schedule due to some miscoordination between me and Zul. So as a result, I don't think I will have enough at all. Wow, Start Lord, yeah. Stack. That's a pretty early bruiser camp, unusual. Another stack. Three stacks. Perfect, the first perfect one, in fact. Yes, it's Hero League, but three specialists is not an issue. Nothing wrong with three specialists. We will get Infernal Glove. A specialist is just something that doesn't fall completely under the rules that Blizzard proposed for them. It doesn't mean that they are poor assassins, like poor primal damage dealers. This is a misconception. Wow, 
We have good push power. We have good cancellation of the turn-in points as Asmodan and Zagara. I'd say that ranks pretty well. I thank you. Thanks for hosting great streams all week. Ready for WC3 tomorrow. Cheers. Thanks, Panama Red. I'm ready for it too. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure, dude. Did we just lose some gems on the Rexar? Maybe. Asmodan is great against Li Ming's Arcane Orbs. Demon Warriors. They do some nice work to cancel them land from landing on us. On this map, in order to effectively stack, you want to make sure not to send your General of Hell into a lane that you are currently trying to farm from. You would kill the front line too fast friend. and fail coordination of a globe on the entire thing. Oh, damn, they're paid. What you need to try and do is to clear a wave together with your friends and then General of Hell it afterwards. To make it harder for them to clear and to slow their rotation when they try to do that. bolster your minions against their objective. I mean against three or four. I was trying to wait for the cooldown of the Tassadar shield to run out and then to land a Q in an unexpected place where they would not be likely to find themselves. How many stacks do I have? 150! That's my target! Nice, I'm glad. That's exactly how many I tried to get in the new patch, minimum. Hey, Semi Azaz TV. Thank you very much for subbing, man. So this is when I put the General of Hell, just to slow down on the wave that they are trying to clear. If I had one, I would do it here now. They are having trouble keeping up with our wave clear. Fountain, though I would like to have more mana at this particular point because I've been farming all along and um, actually too late now but the quest goes on 204 stacks yes 4k grubby here hello vagrant I like what we are summoning nice Ooh, nice damage on thrall now this laser goes at a direct cost of my map presence and stacking but it adds some damage. Oh, try to remove yourself from the fight. That was for you, Crowtail. An attempt, anyway. Too bad about the take dance. I don't have enough mana to soak the whole way. So I have to prepare them first. Just like so. So, not the best Wet Weaver phase ever. I am hard standing, careful guys. Considering they're using the StarCraft 2 engine, would you like to see a HOTS map editor for fan created maps? Oh, so much, yes, darkness. If one, because some of the coolest maps in the history of Blizzard games have been made by fans and two because it would show the blizzard developers a whole new world about things that could happen 
which would uh, innovate the map making process even from uh, talented map designers like Blizzard themselves. Never stand in the minion wave against Asmodan. He loves it when you do that. Doctors hate it. I'll go for Hellforged armor. Here comes my three dollars. Nope. I've been taking a lot of March of Sin usually, but now I find myself going to Burning Rage Demon Warriors. I find it really funny and useful. Ancestral is so close to hitting. I need a breather. Come on and slam, and welcome to the jam. I have 272 stacks. I have not evolved much from my level 12 point. That's because I've also been shooting some B balls at the opponent. is that we cannot take those gems. Enemy web weavers. Ooh. Oh, they're coming for me. I see. Thanks for the warning too, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. Four man hit. Holy, holy. Holy, holy. Now you see Tassadar's problems against Asmodan. Thanks, Dono083. Battleborn. Damn. Let's pay. Damn. Try not to corner an Asmodan. Pulling yourself without clicking there. Alt R. Alt R. So you just check when you're in range of the Q by hovering over it. And then once you get in range, you just press Alt R. You don't have to look at how. Looks like we're fighting without me, which is risky. But look, we're a specialist team. Zul's mid lane, I'm a uh, bot. But now I want to go to a team, actually. Though they are not going hard, which is pretty nice. I mean, they're not going ham. I can just do this. I see everyone top, so I'm not really at risk here. They're getting out specialists. Oops, I missed that one.
Boom! <laughs> He's looking for an entomb. He's angry. Oh. Yeah, crow tail. That's one. One dunk on snitch. <laughs> Feels good, man. Good guy, Leoric, trapping his Liming. Woohoo! Three eighty-eight stacks. Noise. I think it's over, right? Yeah. GG. And Stark Lord is a grubby sub. Let's give a clap up for him. Sometimes when I alt R on Asmodan, I accidentally alt Q myself. Does it happen to you as well, or am I the only one? You're not the only one, it happens to Trixler as well. <laughs> Hope he's not here. And this is why triple specialist is okay, because you've got great wave clear. Look at that siege damage, 160, 160. Zagara is the best solo laner here, and they have 100k all. Nice. I'm gonna come bottom too. It's gonna be 5v4 if you can do that. Yeah. Nice. I'm lagging. Nice. Nice. I'm lagging. I got Burrow 